Here's a video, walk the room, room 17, 818. Come in here, and first of all, let's check out the bathroom. Pretty standard, but well-appointed toilet with a necessary telephone. Very weird, tiny television, because you can't have a room without a television, you know. A couple of sinks, nice big shower. But check out this tub, this thing's awesome. It's huge. It takes like 10 minutes to fill up and then it's got jets. Easily fit two people in there. Took a bath in it yesterday, that was really nice. Let's turn this off. Some art that I haven't really noticed before. An ice bucket, doesn't even get filled for me. <laughs> nice comfy bed with the duvet. Sitting area table, television mounted to the wall with a DVD player, in case you're ancient. You've got a little coffee pot, a toaster, which is an interesting touch I'm not going to use, a blender, because you got to make margaritas, refrigerator, got some water and beer in there, sink, microwave, a little countertop cooker, which I may or may not end up using with real basic cooking supplies, so that's kind of cool. I mean, there's so much food in Vegas that I don't imagine using this much, but maybe for a cup of tea. And then um, one of my favorite aspects of it is the view over here. There's this crazy golf thing down there. It's like a driving range, but look at that. It's four floors of driving range where people just stack up and I guess hit the ball out. And then I guess these spots like catch the balls and give you a score. And then right out there, that's the airport, so we can actually watch planes coming and going, which is a kind of a fun little backdrop. We're facing away from the strip. 